All right, it's got this kit from uh, FedEx here. It's from uh, Mushroom Adventures. It's the white button mushrooms. And uh, basically it's a big box. I just opened it up. This is your casing. It's got all your, uh, it's got peat moss and I guess uh, spores or the mycelium. This is your uh, compost the mushrooms grow in. So pretty much you just add some water to this uh, casing here and a little bit of compost and we're going to spread it over the, uh, uh, the uh, compost. Okay, so in this bag here with a peat moss, the casing I guess, I added a eight ounces of water and then about a cup of uh, it's called, it's, uh, mulch here, or compost they call it, two at the bag and I gotta mix it up and then uh, put all that stuff on top of the uh, compost. One thing I did want to add is the instructions said it doesn't have to be in a dark place, you don't have to put it in a closet, but it has to maintain between like 55 and uh, 70 degrees depending on what type of mushrooms you have. Um, you can put it in a room that's got light, but it can't have direct exposure to sunlight. So I got a place we'll put on top of the kitchen cabinets because there's not really a place in the closet to put it. So okay, I've added the casing to the top. You just put it in there loosely and uh, about an inch thick. I taped up the uh, plastic in the uh, sides of the box to keep it up, keep it out of the mushrooms. But uh, anyway, I'm gonna take a butter knife. I'm gonna scratch. This is a scratch some rows in it. That's all I'm going to do all the way down through here and uh, find a place to put it and uh, let it grow and uh, get back with you when something happens. Alright, this is day 23 for the mushrooms. You can see the mycelium down there. I'm not too sure, but I believe that's where them are mushrooms that are going to come up. There's a bigger one there. There's some mycelium here. It's kind of dry. I got it missed a couple days of water and it kind of dried out but you can see there's new growth coming up in here so hopefully in a few days I'll have some mushrooms or so if we can zoom in here macro and there it is starting to come up there so that's cool started these on Valentine's Day and today is uh, March 3rd I believe so anyway, I'm getting ready to spray these down. I missed them with water. And uh, see what we got here in a few days. Alright, day 21 of the mushroom kit. And you can see them popping up, finally. So that's pretty cool. There's the biggest one there. So, they're coming up. Let me see if I can put this in macro. Anyway, I'd say the next few days they'll uh, they should be up pretty good. So, might be harvesting our first crop of mushrooms here in the next few days. All right, it's about uh, three days later, and as you can tell I've got mushrooms. So, that's what we got. So I'm gonna cut them here. Um, I'm gonna use them for supper tonight. Okay, I've cut them. There's the stems. I've left a few in there. I'm gonna let them grow, but uh, here's what we got for supper tonight. So, ain't bad. Pretty cool. Here's the biggest one. It'll eat. I love all kinds of mushrooms. So, this kit's pretty cool. Um, I guess there's supposed to be more mushrooms coming. You can still see a few starting to come up. So, we'll see how long this kit lasts. Thanks for watching.